This right here is a jawbreaker candy. If you're not familiar with what a jawbreaker is, it is a very, very hard candy with multiple flavor levels. Meaning, as you suck on it and the different layers of candy start dissolving, you'll start tasting a new flavor. This right here is the world's largest jawbreaker. Now, if this is called a jawbreaker, this is called, I have no idea. Comment down below what it should be called. Actually, they call this the Mega Bruiser. If you wanna get a Mega Bruiser, I'll leave some information about it in the description. But it is a massive, massive jawbreaker. So obviously, putting something like this in your mouth isn't really a problem. But this, on the other hand, Given the fact that it is so damn hard, it's it's hard like a baseball, um, you can't just put it in your mouth. And there's only really one way that I can figure out how to eat this properly, and it's not just to smash it, because I want to see all the rings in the middle. So first, I'm going to head to my dad's workshop, and I'm going to saw this in half. Very, very gently, because I feel like if I start using some kind of electronic tool, it's probably going to just disintegrate. It's going to, you know, just dissolve, like, break into so many pieces. I wanna see all the beautiful layers of candy that is inside. Okay, so I got my macro lens right there. I have uh, secured this big ball right here. I put some padding right here in between it so that it just doesn't get destroyed. I'm trying not to secure it so tight that it cracks. Um, I actually did a couple experiments with um, the little guys, um, I'll show you guys the layers in a second on this one. Oh, there you go, so you guys can see it. Look at all the little layers. But we'll take a closer look in a second. Um, but we're gonna try and saw this in half uh, carefully and uh, precisely and see, uh, see what's inside. <laughs> As I continue to saw through this massive jawbreaker, I wanted to thank Lambs for sponsoring today's video. Lambs makes Faraday and anti-radiation clothing, which blocks Wi-Fi, 3G, 4G, 5G, and more. Use code FURIOUS at checkout to save yourself 10%. Just click the link in the description below. So I started getting a little bit impatient, sort of, and you, if you can, you can see, well, as I was sawing, it starts going a little bit more uh, aggressive. I don't know. If there, you guys can see that crack right there, but I think it's in a good spot. So I'm gonna take it out and see what it looks like. So I'm back from the workshop, and um, it's a masterpiece. It's a masterpiece. Um, what I'm gonna do quickly because of, I guess it's all the coating and the sugar is actually wet it a little bit so you guys can see the layers a little bit more. Check out all these colors, like, and the layers of flavors. That's really what the colors are. The layers of flavors are just, there's so many. I did not expect this. To give you guys an, a, a comparison, I'm gonna show you guys the a normal jawbreaker and what it looks like inside. So here's a normal one, right? And you can see that there are layers of flavors, right? But compared to this one right here, it's just, it's an unbelievable difference. Like, like I am blown away with how cool this looks. I mean, I can't really tell how much bigger this is. I guess on a weight scale, we can kind of compare, but it's much bigger. It's like way bigger. I feel like my light is really bright or something and I can't really can't really see the colors as well. So I'm going to crack open the macro lens so you can really see how beautiful it is.
the world's biggest jawbreaker and the normal jawbreaker, okay? It's an insane difference. I have no idea how this is to actually bite into now that it is cut in half, but we'll see. Um, the other side doesn't look as good. It's got, it, this is basically just, it's just from the saw that I was using. Um, and like, I, I can't get, oh, actually, oh wow. It does look good. <laughs> you just have to wash it off. I didn't realize that. That's perfect. Look at that. That might even look better. Wow, look at that. That looks wonderful. I'm gonna save that little piece for a second. I'm gonna see how hard it is to actually eat something like this. I just answered my question. Yo, what the hell? I guess this is something that you just have to lick. But I'm glad that I cut it through at least. Because I'm totally just like this video, forget the eating part. I'm just amazed at the layers as how how cool that looks. How badass that looks. I did not expect it to look as awesome as it looks. But I don't know why I thought maybe the insides would be a little softer and then I'd be able to get at it. The only soft part is the very, very center. And it's not even soft, it's just softer. Like. <laughs> Let's say I take like a little guy. Oh, this is hard too. I was doing a little experiment beforehand, and I guess I was sucking on it, and then it got soft once I hit the middle part. Okay. Um, um, I don't really know what to do right now because this is, this is something that would take days. I think it was just stupid of me to think that I could actually eat this. I think it's just been so many years since I've had a jawbreaker then, you know, I haven't had one since I started doing competitive eating, started doing eating challenges many, many years ago, and I could usually just bite through everything and eat everything, but... Um, if I want to keep my teeth... Perhaps there'll be an update in one, two, three weeks, four weeks. Perhaps I'll just get diabetes first. I think I have to end the video. I, I didn't want to end it on that note. I wanted to destroy this. I have not made a debt. Like, at all. Zero. And then, there, it's not just this half. It's this half as well. Like, I have not made a single dent in this. So on that note, we'll catch you guys in the next video. Um, I hope you at least really enjoyed what it looks like on the inside. Because um, that took me a while to saw. It was a good workout. You know, because I need that. I'm Furious Pete. We're Team Furious, dedicated for life, D4L. And as always, my friends, you guys stay sexy, stay hungry, and of course, get laid. Boom.